Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So today I will show you how to use the history command. So are you ready? Let's get started. So actually as you may know the history command allow us to view the previously executed command in the terminal. So if you type for example history you will get a list of all the commands that you have executed and in front of each command as you can see here there is a number so I will show you how to use this number later okay so here I can of course show the commands page by page using the more command so if I type history then I redirect the output to the more command of course I can just display the commands page by page so if I press space in my keyboard I will get the next page if I want to quit all I have to do is to press the Q button in my keyboard okay of course I can also redirect the output to the grab command so I can search for a specific command using the grab command so if I type for example pink it will list all the previously pings that I have executed as you can see here all the pings that I have executed before okay so if I tap again history if you notice I don't have the timestamp in front of each command I can display that timestamp because sometimes it's very helpful so if you want to display the timestamp of each command all you have to do is to execute this command export hist time format then equal then uh, percentage capital F space percentage capital T and space then it's finished okay actually the capital F stands for the year, month and the day and the capital T is actually the hour, minute and seconds. So if I hit enter and if I execute the history command again, as you can see now in front of each command I have the timestamp. Okay. So as I told you before, if you want to execute a command corresponding to a number, for example, let's say I want to execute uh, this pink command here, the number that, that is front of it is actually 945. So if I want to execute it, it's pretty easy. You have to type exclamation sign, then the number, which is 945. And the command now is being executed. Okay. There is another trick if you want to search all these commands, you can just type in your keyboard Ctrl then R. And now I have a reverse I search. So whenever I type a keyword, it will list all the commands that has that keyword. So for example, if I type ping. I have ping here, if I type list for example, control R and list, it will list the command that begin with that keyword. I can execute it if I press just enter and I can also edit it using the row keys if I want. Okay. So I can just type, for example, etc. if I want, something like this. Okay. Another useful thing is how to clear all the previously commands in your history. You can execute that. You can actually do that using the option minus C. So if I tap history minus C, now all my history commands are cleared. So if I tap history, 
I will have nothing, just history commands. Okay. So that was just a brief introduction on how to use this history command, which is very helpful when you are using a lot of commands in your terminal. As always, I hope it has been informative for you. And I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye.